it's time for another idea to make 2023 even better than 2022. Stay tuned for this week's tip. This week's tip is based on a great finding, and that is that little changes lead to big results over time. I first considered this concept when I read the book, The Compound Effect by Darren Hardy. He wrote that book in 2010. Years later, Atomic Habits by James Clear shares a similar message, another great book. But this idea was even popularized much earlier than Darren or James by none other than Albert Einstein. Albert Einstein famously said, compound interest is the eighth wonder of the world. He who understands it, earns it. He who doesn't, pays it. Now, this isn't a financial lesson, though that's what Albert was referring to. What I'm talking about is the idea that if you continually invest by doing these small things or putting a small amount of money aside, Eventually, it leads to something fantastic and something much larger than you ever imagined. Here's an example that maybe you can relate to. Start doing a small amount of reading every day in a chosen field. Let's say that you want to get better at management. So you pick one management book that's considered to be one of the best out there and you start reading a few pages every day, just a few pages. Over time, you find you work your way through the book and it's done. You journal some of the reading tidbits that you got from the book, some of the great lessons, and then you move on to another book and you work your way through that book or you take an online course and you slowly work your way through that. And as you're learning these new ideas about management, you make small changes to the way you manage. Those small changes lead to other people seeing you as a better manager. It starts as a small idea that you're a better manager, but then it leads to a bigger understanding that you are clearly setting yourself apart from regular managers as an above average manager. Over time, you get better and better and better. I heard about this concept from Brian Tracy as well many years ago. This idea that when you get just a little bit better, over time, you really separate yourself from the pack. You decide you want to pour yourself into a new area of development, but you don't need to make big changes. You don't have to spend hours and hours a day just spend 15 minutes a day, 15 minutes a day, investing in something new for you, whether it's exercise, diet, learning how to manage, how to sell, how to be a better parent, how to have better relationships, how to deal with conflict. It doesn't matter. The idea is you know that you can be better in this area and you're going to start spending 15 minutes a day, even 10 minutes a day. Does that sound like too much? How about 10 minutes a day, even five minutes a day? The point is it's daily and it's consistent and it's a small effort. And I promise you that you will see what the authors of the books that I've told you, what Albert Einstein realized, you will see what I've realized in my own life, in your life, that the compound effect will be something that will blow you away and will also blow your competition away. So tell me, what will you invest just a few minutes of each day into getting better at or learning more about next year? I'd love to hear in the comments below. If this has benefited you, then watch last week's video if you didn't watch it already and be sure to be ready for next week's video because this whole month is dedicated to ideas to help you be better next year. If you'd like to learn more about my coaching and training, visit my website, buildandbalance.com. Until next time, invest in yourself.